is only from the mouth, not from the heart. Because serving God, imagine I walk in their life. When I do my familiar, familiar studies or, or come and study, I come to Qantas or Melbourne, Australia at the time. Uh, we have NZ Australia and NZ New Zealand or go to uh, New Zealand. That's, that's how international work together. But the church, what church is that? I don't speak to them. I will not be good near them. Same Bible, same Holy Spirit, same Jesus. Hallelujah. I speak like that because 21 years as a new Methodist, as we grew from power to power, just relying on God, I, I know what ridicule is. My children, they go to airport school when they were primary school, and the girls go over to uh, Jasper, or my only son go to international school. When they come back, they will talk within themselves because of the message that I preach. Till today, they are all married and they are successful in this life. And they support me as a ministry. While other Tantal, they struggle with their sons, they struggle with their daughters. And I'm really blessed just because I'm preaching and I'm trying to walk. I'm trying to walk the talk. And I try to talk the walk. And I try to walk, walk, and talk the talk, and walk the talk. When I talk about tithe, I do my tithe. I always share my tithe in one month is 1,000. But there is no salary for me. You see the pastor when you met this, you know. And I believe I'm the only cousin living in Fiji that we don't have salary. Even the senior pastors, they don't have salary. We trust in God. I trust in God. I left 50 grand in 2005. 50 grand. And my boss came down, the Chinese man, he said, Art, what is this? I said, my resignation. Resignation letter said, We are already earmarking you for senior management. Who will pay for your mortgage? I said, it's a calling that I feel with him. You know, you know, pray, so we pray for airplane, we pray for pilot, we pray for the weather. And that God that we, I used to rely on is calling me times up. Amen. Imagine if you trust God in your other life. Imagine when you trust God in that. What God can do. We were sailing from Manumalau and we were going to Vivia. And it was the weather was not good. In the middle of the ocean, three fiberglass, three fiberglass from Manumalau, two hours in the middle of the sea, past Mamo to Vivia. And we were just praying. By the end of the of our prayers, we feel that the sea start to come down. And we took off from Manumalau and go down to Vivia. The churches they tried to block, but the come preach wherever you want to set up. And I praise God. The door that God opened, no man can close. And the door that God closed, no man can open. From the year we go down to Nayao. From Nayao we go to, to La Kemba. Three nights in La Kemba. From La, La Kemba. And then the middle, middle of the night we say from La Kemba to Como. That is the southern law. Como more than Muka, Kambara, Ongea, Flama. That's the southern law. In the middle of the night. Yehuto Nyao and three fibers. Three fibers in front. And somehow we were caught up by, by a swell in the middle of the ocean. And we see the hands of God. Because in my young days, I normally travel with my father in a canoe from island to island. When God opens the door, no man can close. You are sitting here, God opened the door for you to come to Australia. No man can close. No man. And there are greater things. I love what Tantan Kasisukani. He said, this is not it. Do you think that you are blessed already? No. That's it. You haven't seen enough. When you walk with the hands of God, I tell you, your children will stand up one day and testify. The sacrifice our dead did so many years ago. That's why I can join the British Army. That's why I can become a pilot. That's why I, I, I can pay my fare to go to universities. Just because of the sacrifice. My dad did so many years ago. If God opened this door for you, if God allowed the Israelites to set free the biggest J 